All right, so I've decided to keep the brains off for for at least right now. I've decided to keep the brains. I, I, I erased it apparently. Uh, keep the brains off of this chip. This chip is just going to be a dummy. Um, it's just going to do exactly as it's told. And I'm either going to make a new one in the future, which is going to be a lot more complicated and a lot more involved than what I'm willing to put up with right now, and or it is going to be it in line with the brain. So instead of um, a chip with, you know, brains on it and... Um, Right, that's somebody's arm. Instead of brains and muscle, it'll be two separate chips. One with brains, one with muscle. And um, I can send commands into here and do that. But it'll be in series with it. But if I want to, in the meantime, I can just chop this up, only have the brain, only have the muscle, and use the brains somewhere else and do that. So it's separate, completely separate thing. Um, yeah, so that's what I'm planning on doing. So... Yeah. Oh. <laughs> There's my mouse. All right. Um. I need a resistor. Um, I'm going to want to use a commonly found resistor. So if I just type uh, 10KR, I think is what I'm looking for. 10K resistor. Uh, can I sort by availability? Hmm. Is there a better part searcher that they have? This is kind of small. Um, I want to search by stock. Okay, I can do this. I can search by resistor. Resistors. Uh, I do not want through hole. I want chip resistor. Package the size of it. I want 0805. Yeah. And I want a resistance of 10. Um, yep, that's what I want. Apply filters. All right, they have quite a few in stock. Um, yep, that looks good. And I'm going to place this guy. I'm going to want two of these. Put the, oh, oh, my. Put him right there. Right. And, uh... What? Can I rotate you? Yeah. Hmm. No, I don't like it. And now I want a transistor. Nope, that's not what I want. So... Transistor. MOSFET. Alright, this guy right here. Who are you? Data sheet? It's probably gonna be in Chinese, yeah. Oh no, it's half and half. Alright, um, 30 volts. Max of 12. Continuous current. 5 amps! Uh, do you mean... 5.8 milliamps? That is a fat resist. Uh, all right. That's uh, bigger than what I need. How much did it cost? One cent? That doesn't seem right. Let's see if I. Nexperia. I remember that company name. That's actually might have been the one I was looking at earlier. Uh, 60 volts, 20 volts max. Uh, 
ID continuous, 300 milliamps. Yeah, I think, I think this is the same one. All right, we'll go with that for my next period place. I'm gonna want one of these over here. Oh, it even has a flyback diode in. And I want to flip this, flip, 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 flip. These are NMOS. These are just different symbols for NMOS. Um, gate. Um, save. Going to ground. Do I have a ground symbol? These are both ground. All right, we just have two of them, I guess. Oh, you weren't supposed to go up there. Hmm. All right. P one D. P one D was my P one D. Ah. So this dot is right here. So we'll put a little dot there, just to so keep track of it better. All right. So that's P one D. Oh, A. Yeah. Yeah. Drain. Okay. Yeah. So that's um, beep, beep, beep. this one here. All right, that's out output. So just bring that down there. Oh no, hello. Okay, I have to connect it to something. Um. Bah, bah, bah. Put a no connect on it then. Is there a no connect? No connect. I'll say no connect, but I'll connect it to something later. Uh, a, a jumper thing. I just don't want to have to worry about that right now. Um, it's not the best practice, I'm aware. All right, and then I want power to go on that. So, oh wait, net label. Ooh, ooh. Off page, yeah, off page. Off page connector, net port. Yeah, okay, that'll work. Okay, so net port. Ah, oh, come on. P1S, P2S, P1S, P2S. Right. And then this is also ground. Ah, I have to. And then this is output A. here for can I put a net label in the middle of space I can well, that's not great I want this to be called we wanted to call it in a wanted to call this 
this NB. That's going to bother me. No. No. Oh, that is infuriating. Uh, I'm just going to leave it. I don't care. Enough. All right. Um, I need power. And I need ground. Not sure why they have downs like that. And it's an N channel, next period, yeah. Drain source. Yeah, that looks right. Um, okay, should I name stuff? I think huh. I think I'll leave it like this for now. Output A, output B. So now I want to save, just in case, design, convert, schematic to PCB. Uh, yeah, check nets. What's wrong? What are you mad about? Oh, it's complaining that it goes out to nowhere, but that's fine. I will handle that later. Um, and I don't feel like finding a thing for it. I, I checked for them like a few months ago and wasn't very happy with how it was set up. Um, let's get it through. I should be able to fit everything on two layers. Yeah, che makes it cheaper too. Because you can have a lot of layers, but it's cheaper if you just have two layers. Uh, let's start at zero, zero, and let's go to, I don't know, 
make it much bigger than we need. Let's make it 50 by 50. And of course, positive is down. All right. Um, I want to grab some stuff. That's the, this is the standard spacing. Actually, you know what, I should go back to DigiKey, make sure that they follow that 10 mil, or uh, 2.54. 100 mil spacing, 10th of an inch. Um. Terminal block. Wire to board they probably don't follow 10 mil spacing. They probably follow a much, much bigger spacing. Terminal block. Two position. I'm going to want a four position terminal block. And I can select that up here. Uh, maybe I'm missing it. Manufacturer series packaging. Number of levels. Positions. Okay, here we go. Four. I don't want any of these fancy schmancy ones where you like, you push down on it and it works. Oh, but it's by Phoenix. Phoenix is a is a name brand. <sighs> Do I want this? Ooh, this one's by TE. I like TE. Ah. I shouldn't. I should go with what I know works. And I should not. Oh, no. I want two, two position. That's what I want. Four position in and two position out. Ah, choices. I really want to go with these. They look cool, and I think they make some things easier. <sighs> hmm. All right, three point five millimeter spacing. <sighs> I shouldn't be doing this. I should go with what I know works instead of just guessing. But oh, this is not a data sheet. This is a brochure. <laughs> it's only two pages. Um, I think it's this one here. But maybe it's this one. But that's not even listed in here. What? 3.5 millimeters. Okay, 3.5. Okay, good. But these are not the same. Maybe it's this one. And it's only yellow up here because of why not? One, two, one, two, eight, three. One, two, eight, three, four, eleven. Four, eleven dash four, four, eleven dash four. Okay, so it's this one. Okay. Uh, digital data sheet. What? No, go away. Go away. Ah, oh, don't tell me that. Much better. This is a data sheet. Mm, closer to a data sheet. Six amps, that's plenty. Push in. Yeah, that's fine. But you don't have any drawings? of its sizing and stuff. Like how thick are the legs? How, how, how big do I need to make the, the legs for the... Tin, copper. Not 
not a big fan of this. This is not a good data sheet. Ooh, drawings. Okay, better, 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 better. Okay, lovely. Okay, they could have just had this on the same one. All right, we are looking at um, A plus five, point five. A, A, A. Oh, okay. So it's five and a half positions, and then this is 3.5 on average. So 3.5 times 4.5. This is a 15 millimeter wide block. All right. 15 millimeter wide block, 3 millimeter spacing, uh, and here we are. 0.4, so we should say 0.6 should be big enough, I think, for that. And the spacing between is oh they're staggered oh oh okay so it goes one on the back one on the front okay so let me um the way these terminal blocks go is they have one conductor down here, then a boop, boop, boop. And so uh, when I run my traces, I'll make sure that I have to... Ah, oh, that's going to be a... All right, but distances between here is 3.5, and the distances between here and here is 5.2. And the uh, size of that is uh, oh, 0.7. So we'll say uh, one millimeter. All right, that should work. That should fit. All right, let's roll with it. So we can close this one. Uh, boop. All right, so I'm going to need to make new videos, I think. Uh, maybe I could start with this via as a source of a starting point. It is not letting me paste. This is uh, infuriating. Copy, copy, copy. Paste. There we go. All right, it's already on ground, but that's not super important. I want to have no affiliation. All right. Um, let's just put you at zero, zero for simplicity. This one, I don't care if it's up or down, we'll do that. Um, it's 5.2 millimeters in the Y, so 5.2, and its X is 3.5. zero an x of 3.5 times 2 oh no we can't do that okay um, 3.5 times 2 is just 7 but some editors let you do math inside of them zoom
that should be a four position terminal block. And uh, which one starts first? So this is the extra side, this is the close side. So this is upside down. This is upside down. So this one, this one, copy with respect to that. That is now right side up. Zoom. There we go. All right, and I want him to be in the middle. R two. Who are you connected to? Do they make two position versions of that? They only make four. So... Change it to two. Positions per level, two. Phoenix, 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 Phoenix. TE. I guess it's fine to use Phoenix, but. Hmm. I guess it doesn't matter too much. I don't know. Let me sort by manufacturer. TE. Connectivity. which is actually just like a brochure ah oh here it is position size okay so I already had this document right here um this is the one that I had on the other one yeah 411 and dash 2 has only two positions mm, I clicked dash 2 that's dash 4 there so I'm guessing their link doesn't work. Or maybe I clicked the wrong one. That's not what I clicked. That is on my clipboard. What? Copy link address. Yeah, it says 21. What does it say 21? I want the 21, I want the 11. It says 21, what is this? Uh, I'm, I'm not the biggest fan of TE connectivity, but uh, we'll go. <sighs> what does it look like underneath? Is 
Is it loading or? There we are. Okay, so it follows the same pattern. Just really jumpy. Yeah, same pattern. Um, yeah, all right. from there, paste it up here. I don't think it matters, but rotate, and then put that there. All right. And I can group these as well. So right click, group, 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 group. Which one do you groups? How do you group in this? Oh, it's up here. There's an ability, there's a capability somewhere to group all of these items together. Group. There we go. Um, no prefix. No, no. There we go. So now they're all together, and you group. That's not group. Group. It's really frustrating. There we go. All right. So we can name our nodes now. Uh, we'll make this one power. VDD. We'll make this one ground. We'll make this one A. We'll make this one B. And we'll make this one out A. Actually, if the user is going to be reading it from the other side, this will be out A. And this will be out B. B. Right. So now we just need to uh, solve the rats, rat lines, which is these here. So I want a wire on the top layer track. Um, move these in closer. How big are these? They need an outline. So they are 12 by um, three and a half times the length, or um, three and a half times the length and a half. So, oh. So I want a box rectangle. Is this going to do what I think it is? No, that is a whole region. Oh, that's a region. Huh. The circle layer. So this is just a cosmetic on the top for us to see. this to be start ah, you know it would be easier if we just do it at zero zero hmm. make a line zero zero end at zero on the y and on the x it will be seven which is three and a half times four and a half. Ooh, what is that? Three and a half. That's not what I typed. Three and a half times four and a half. Fifteen point seven five. Y, 
side, negative 12. Okay, and then that should be able to fi finish that up pretty. Oh, no. Start, 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 end zero. And then a wire from here to here. And group, no name. Oh, group, no name. Delete the name. Actually, we'll leave this here. It's going to be called J1. group all of these together. This. Okay, I cannot do that, so we'll leave that as it is, and this is also going to be 12. So, yeah, this is fine. So top layer, copper, yeah, I can do that. And then it would be better if it was less symmetrical, but at least similar. So who are you? Uh, we have ground, yeah, I like that. Um, a, B, A, B. That's wrong. So I need to change that. I need to go to my sheet. And... No, that is right. Yeah, that is right. Distribute. Oop, that's not what I wanted. You're supposed to take the, the end, and when you click distribute horizontally, it's supposed to evenly distribute. Okay, it's not doing that. But it can align them, at least. I was grabbing someone I shouldn't have. There we go. There we go. And align center. Yeah. So flow is going this way. So yeah. So I'm gonna go power to these two. All snake. Okay, 
the stripe. Um, power will go up and over. It's okay if these are small lines because they're weak. Um, This is okay if it's weak. So um, we're gonna do something called a via. So I can have a, now I'm gonna grab the via for my other project. So that is a via. And I want to remove its association. There we go. It will not let me move this via. There we go. Can I move the via? Put the via right there. Okay, they are touching. Writing conflict, ignore. Okay, remove, yeah, copy, paste. So this is just my spare ground. Any needs to go over here, I can snake that by going underneath. Okay, I don't know what happened there. Okay, let's turn back on routing conflicts. Where'd my, where'd my via go? I had a spare via. Now I just need to connect A and B. No, N A. Okay, okay. I think that's probably the best way to. Oh, I didn't connect uh, B. I need to connect B. Just uh, break one of my personal rules. Hello, I'm clicking on you. Hello, thank you. And then this will just be all underground. 
on the bottom layer. <laughs> All right, VDD. Let's make you a thick layer. No, no, no. Oh, yes, I probably would want four layers for that. Huh. So normally, um, what they would do is have a really, really big, every, everything just be coated in power, everything be coated in copper for um, power, everything coated in copper for ground. But uh, on a two-layer board, that might be a bit harder. On a four-layer board, sure, no problem. Uh, but I might just do the lazy way and just have really thick traces, which I, you know that's what I think I'm gonna do. That's what I'm gonna do. Really thick traces for. So instead of 0.254, let's do three millimeters. See how big that is. Yeah. Isn't it angle? Angle, please. This is all right angles. Oh, there we go. 45. There we go. Um, oh, we also don't need this via anymore. Everything should still be connected. Yes. So I can route this just about wherever I want. That was ground. Whoops. Power. Wherever I want. And then ground. To just about wherever I want. NB going to NB, but there's nothing complaining about NB being down the way down. Uh, oh, okay, there we go. Okay, so let me just put this back. 0.254. There, solve that. That should work how I think it will. So I can just come in at three millimeters on the bottom layer. You just cover this entire thing. Yeah. And maybe not maybe not that much. So we'll undo that last one. But zoom. Thank you. And we'll go down to just one millimeter. That's not what I wanted. Here we go. Ah! Just this one guy. Yeah. All right. Um, maybe we could slide this over just a tad. No, we can't. We cannot. What if we do that? And then what? Where's my forty-five? There's my forty-five. What 
is going on? What a oh, this is a disgusting. What? You. That's not what I wanted. Fine. This will go back. Why? Why? Why you do this? Just, I wanted to have a bigger gap here. How big is it? Um, I'm not sure. Pressing Alt. Uh, half. Half a millimeter. Which is fine, I guess, but yeah, pains me. All right, just ignore that for now. Oh, whoopsies. Okay, and I want to route. Oh. I routed power to. Whoopsies. There we go. I can probably get away with a one millimeter wire. Yeah. Well, let's move this closer. It's not perfectly centered, but it's okay. an extra VDD here. Oh, that's from the wire. Alright. Alright. This looks pretty nice. I'd say. Oh, what are you complaining about? Oh. Yep. Uh, wire. 0. 0.254. That's, that's VDD. This is ground. There we go. Is everybody happy? Save. DRC. What are you mad about? There's an extra node in here somewhere. Who? Who is the extra node? You! You random person. Alright, now let's DRC. DRC stands for des uh, Designed Rule Check, and it'll go through a bunch of rules and make sure that you follow them. Um, need more than 0.61 millimeters? Uh, I'm going to be using a service called JLC PCB um, minimum drill size. Ah. Via. Minimum via size. Via. Via. Oh, that's real small. I'm doing a point five. that's plenty. Um... I don't know why 
it insists on doing this. These traces are overkill and not proportionate, but it'll be okay. This board is not square. Oh, wait. Ah. It's not great, but it'll do. Me thinks. Oh, wait, before we do that, what is the terminal bloke? This distance here. So if this is 2.2, .2, this is 2.2, .2, so what is this? Um, Did I put that in right? Five. Five point two. Did I do that? I don't think I did that right. So this here is DX. Okay, so if I click center of that and come over to this, then my mouse DX. Is 3.5. My mouse dy is 5.2. Oh, okay, good. If I zoom in a bit, right there to right there. 5.2, 3.59. Sweet. Okay, cool. I did do that right. So I want to find out what this distance is. So if this whole distance is 12. So. Uh, 12 minus 2.2 .2 minus 5.2 is 4.6, 4.6. Or actually, no, I just, I just need this distance, 2.2. Uh, .2. So, right now it's 3.6. And that's plenty. I will leave that as it is. Three point three as well. Plenty of room for mistakes and stuff. I hope. It's like a whole millimeter. Okay, so what are my other errors? What are you mad about? What? What what are you mad at? Incomplete connection. Well, there you go. I want that to be one, one millimeter. Boop, 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 boop. All right, DRC. Uh, INA to INA, we only need 0.254, which is a tenth of an inch. All right, and U, VDD. Ah. 
That's getting it a bit close. <laughs> what if I do this number? Yeah, yeah. delete both of these, keep the one millimeter on this, but have a 0.254. I'll go from here to here. All right. Yeah, I can work with that. Oh. Keep track. Oh, these are two. Oh, all right. Yep, no problem. They are crossing over each other, which is bad. Um, so I can put a veer clearance node. And then bridge underneath. All right. So now we have a path, DRC. Orange or yellow is just a uh, paint on the top that we can see. That's all right. Looks pretty, pretty good. Maybe I want a mounting screw. Do I want that? Hmm. I probably do. Probably do, but I think I'm too far lazy. Let me go to the bathroom.